return to our little riddler's riddle. And I can confirm the first person to work out this riddle is Sonic14000, so well done dude. It's not a hard riddle, it's just basic perspective. If I move up to these wool blocks, I'll get the right perspective to answer the puzzle. Place the corner. Grapple now. Pull myself up. Turn and give myself the right perspective. You should see Riddler's favourite symbol, the question mark. So you did it! Well done! I would have expected a child to work that one out, let alone the world's greatest detective. Right, <laughs> let's move on. Riddler did say that there should be an escape a way out. Riddler always follows up with that. And obviously this pressure plate is quite obvious. This is an explosion. Let's clear this rubble out of the way and see what's happened. A watery exit. Not the most graceful, but an exit nonetheless. Now we can see nicely that I, I have come out in the water near the shack and shed. So if I just swing over, I believe we're safe for now. Edward Norton's not one for combat. His riddles come randomly sparse. Because that's his nature. I don't believe there's any danger here, so we can get back inside, take off the bat suit, get some rest. There's a creeper there. Get some rest. And then move on. It's time to advance again and take it. I don't believe he'll be a threat. Hello, and welcome back to Batman Plays Tech It, or Tech It Batman Style. Something along those lines. I don't even know the, my own name of my own series. I am back, and it's time to progress in Tech It. So, we recently created that extractor. We need to power it. We need a generator right there, on that there. Right there. Right. Okay, got it. So, I'm going to start that out with what we have here. So, if I just type in generator like Generation Hollow or something. Who's that? Sounds awesome. Yeah, yeah, me. Okay, so I need a machine block and a furnace to start out with. I'm pretty sure I can handle the furnace and the machine block as well. That was some, yeah, some pro placement here. Machine block. Next we need a furnace and that's cobblestone in the exact same pattern. And boom, furnace. Now the other one's a bit more complicated by the looks of it. I need a battery. How do I power that? I've no idea. But I know that you can make one basically with redstone and stuff. Battery. So I won't do that, but there you go. Two redstones, four tin, and copper cable. Copper cable. Yeah, I've got that. Right, let's make a copper cable. Copper in the centre, uh, rubber on the outside like a sandwich. This will be the most disgusting sandwich ever known to man. I don't know if that's true. Just throw everything on the floor, don't worry about it. I got this. Right, and after that, got redstone, just like that, I believe, and then where's tin? Tin! Okay. Battery! Okay. How the fuck do I power it? Okay, potentially I don't have to charge it, but I feel like I will have to. See if I can just off memory remember how to do this. Yes, furnace, machine block, battery. Holy shit, that worked! I didn't need to do any powerage. Apparently, if I put a, um, battery inside a generator, it'll fill it up. So yeah, sweet. So we have fuel next to that. Okay, so yeah, got the generator going. I believe it takes coal. It's it started. Okay. Something's happening. Cool. Um, I need those rubber... This whole thing has been for the rubber wood. To see what happens with that. I believe it's basically to extremely quick, like much more renewable than constantly placing rubber trees and cutting them down and then you know taking the sap. I just put the tree actual parts in there. Oh, that's cool, look at that. It's like a red it looks like blood to show that it's working. And then we get rubber much faster. Sweet. That is taking that is taking all the coal. I'm not sure what's going on here. I feel like it's just constantly being powered up. I'm going to need a lot more coal. Um, apparently there's something called a bat box. 
Apparently, I, I feel like that would be useful for whatever reason. So it needs, it just needs wood, and some batteries. Batteries, of course. I've completely forgot how to make immediately. No, I got tin on the outside, rubber on the center, and a copper cable. Yeah. Okay, we need three of those. I don't think we're going to be able to... No. Okay. Okay, this is obviously a problem that I need to fix, so if I'm going to make a back box, I'm going to need another battery. Now... Hang on. Anyway, I'm just I'm just going to go uh, fix that problem. I've, uh, I've completely... That made me completely lose my train of thought. Um, I need another battery. Okay, I'll I'll go get one. And we're back. Having done some mining down in the safe mine, I've, uh, I've quite I found quite a few things. Uh, I got lots of nickelite, the fake diamond, rubies, emeralds, sapphires. I got another uranium, some lapis. Maybe it'll finally ever use some gold ore that I've yet to refine. And you know this kind of sh this kind of shit. Um. And I got some tin and some batteries that I need to put together with these. So we should be able to now make the bat box, which is hilarious because I'm Batman. Yes. Not sure what I'm doing with that iron there. Right. So, correct to assume that I should sandwich those together. I need some redstone. Balls. Okay, redstone. Attempt number two. Okay. Redstone on the inside. And where the hell's my tin? There it is. Tin on the outside. Creating a battery. Now we have three. Apparently that's different. That it's not. Because I want to stack. Um, just pick those up. And we should be able to create our bat box. How do we do that? Uh, looking at a macerator. Apparently my next objective is a macerator. I really have no idea what that is. I feel apparently it doubles the progress. So, right, so three batteries and copper and then wood on everywhere else. Do I have any wood? No, I've got to get some out. Wood planks. Okay. So, three batteries, wood everywhere, and. Was it redstone? Oh god, I've immediately forgot. Oh god, it's copper cable. I have no copper cable? Oh, wait, yes, I do. Bat box. Ironic. Okay. Place that there. What does a bat box do, you ask? Well, apparently, it charges and fuels things. So if I was to put a battery in there, I could fuel it up. And everything in the world seems to consume so much coal recently. So much coal. I just dropped them on the ground. So I need to... Okay, it doesn't take coal. Does it take redstone? Wow, it takes redstone. And that powers it. And if I get another battery, I do believe I should be able to. If I get some redstone, I just completely consumed. Okay. Redstone on the inside. Tin on the outside. And cable. Alright. Now grab this battery, put it in here, and that should fuel. Yeah. So, battery. And a battery's much better than coal, which will fill my generator. That is so useful. Such a like nice, neat little system. Oh, I should put that in there wrong. Oh, wait, no, I didn't. I should be fueling it. It should be. Let's go in here. Yeah, okay. So the battery goes in the extractor, the extractor gets fueled like that. Or I can use the generator. Generator is used for a lot of other things, but uh, right now I have no idea what those things are. So, what we need to do now is make our macerator, which basically doubles the intake of everything by turning it into dust and then those get turned into ingots. Someone had a go at me for my pronunciation of that word. Uh, right, what's going on here? Yeah, just chopping it through. Barely taking anything. Awesome. Got so much rubber now. Okay, so the macerator can go here, and I need to make it first, so what do I need? Macerator. Cobblestone, flint, and machine... Okay, machine blocks the first thing, the first hurdle. 
So, get some iron. Oh, we've got iron. Calm down, self. We'll just take that. Yep. Uh, what else do we need? We need flint. I've got some flint in here somewhere. Somewhere. Don't punch me. Okay, there we go. Flint. I need cobbles. I've got a lot of cobbles down. And the next thing that I need to get is this. We need some copper cables. We need another refined iron. So we'll just whack another in there. Da -da -da. There it is. Okay. Everything just gets so confusing so fast. Okay. Copper cables. Next objective. Come on, brain. Work with me. Sandwich between rubber. I've got absolutely fuck loads of rubber now. Sweet. So, rubber on the outside. Let's just put some on here. Okay. And copper on the inside. We need a lot of it. That'll do, I'd say, for now. Just be sparse with it. Be sparse with it. Okay. Brain. On the macerator. Okay. Find iron. Redstone. I've got redstone. I've got everything but the refined iron. Now I've got it. Just one more check. I apologise for the amount of times I'm checking this. I just want to make sure. Okay. Redstone on the outsides. A refined iron on the inside. And then all of the cables form the sandwich. And then we have it. Cool. Should be done. We need the machine block next. Seems to be a lot of uh, machine blocks involved in these machine blocks. You get what I did there. It was a, joke. It was a funny joke, was that? Okay. A uh, couple stone and flint. Flint on the top. Cobblestone on the outsides. This goes there. Machine block goes not there, but there. Macerator. Okay. How do I use it? What do? Place. It. Well, there's an impressive block. So if I put iron ore in here, does it want coal? No. I'm not putting all my redstone in. That last machine ate it all. It takes redstone. Or a battery. Which I've still got some left. I think I'll take that out. And put that in there. And that should fill the battery. Oh wait, that's doing the opposite of what I want. <laughs> that's cool that I can put the battery power back in. Battery's full again. Iron dust. Okay. Okay, I've worked it out, and by worked it out, I didn't use Google. So, basically, if I then smelt that, I, I'm going to explain it now. So, what I did is I created a macerator. I put one iron block into it that I mined, and that created two iron dust. So, one made two, literally. One block made two iron ingots. So... The best way to explain that is, if I picked up one piece of dirt, and then... Okay, that, that makes no sense. Let's try, let's try that again. So if I mined, I don't know, some copper, and then I smelted it, obviously that makes one copper bar. However, if I mined one copper, put it into a macerator, I now have two copper bars. So basically, it literally doubles everything you get. Holy crap, I should have made one of those sooner. Wow. So... Let's, uh, let's recap, gentlemen. We have a macerator makes twice the amount of bars and usage of everything. It just literally doubles the progression rate. A bat box for Batman. It is a way to power your machines and you, obviously my batteries and stuff like that. And I have to be careful because apparently if I get over 32 something EU, I don't know what it means, it'll blow up. So, I don't know, bear that in mind or something. Next we have the extractor, that is for extracting rubber, I'm sure there's more usage for it and I'll, I'll learn them eventually. And it's just a way to much more efficiently gather rubber than slowly cutting down and putting trees back up. That's a spider, he'll stay out there. And the generator powers everything, 
especially the extractor, keeping that power up right there. Um, I think that's about it for this episode. We've done some mining, we've done some riddles. I, I, but I did actually get attacked at one point. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. And if you'd like to know about something, I have a Twitter, uh, Generate Hollow. I'll have a link to that now, I suppose. And it's a good way to talk to me, ask me questions. And if you'd like to just interact with me there, here's some quotes from uh, some previous tweets I've done on screen now. Pretty impressive stuff. If you'd like more of that, go over there, go follow or whatever. Twitter is weird, I don't understand it. And um, yeah, check out my other set episodes, and thanks for watching.